Joe Biden chooses a Chinese car over. Luxury brands, the reason behind it. Joe Biden recently made a surprising decision that has been making headlines all over the world. Hey! Sold his luxurious Rolls Royce boat tail and chose to buy the Changli Nimika, a Chinese car instead. This unexpected move has left many people wondering why he would choose a car from a Chinese. Manufacturer over luxury brands. In this video, we will explore the reason behind Joe Biden's decision and what it could mean for the future of the auto industry. Joe Biden's car choice surprises many. When it comes to the choice of luxury vehicles, many expect political figures to gravitate towards the likes of Rolls-Royce or Bentley. So, when President Joe Biden's car of choice was revealed to be a Changli Nemeka, a Chinese-made electric car, it certainly turned a few heads. While the Changli Nemeka may not have the same name recognition as the Rolls-Royce boat tail, it certainly offers its own unique advantages, particularly when it comes to affordability and eco-friendliness. So, why did Joe Biden choose to forego the luxury brands in favor of a Chinese car? The answer lies in his commitment to sustainable transportation. As the world faces a climate crisis, the push towards electric vehicles has become more urgent than ever, and Biden's choice of car reflects his belief in the need to make the shift towards sustainable transportation. Of course, there were also financial considerations to take into account. The Rolls-Royce boat tail is estimated to have a price tag of around $28 million, making it a luxury item only accessible to the super wealthy. Meanwhile, the Changli Mimica comes in at a much more affordable price point, making it accessible to a wider range of people. Overall, Joe Biden's choice of car may have been unexpected, but it speaks to his commitment to sustainable transportation and accessible luxury. Whether it's the Rolls-Royce boat tail or the Changli Namika, at the end of the day, it's all about finding the vehicle that best meets your needs and priorities. The Rolls-Royce boat tail and its exorbitant price. The Rolls-Royce boat tail is not your ordinary car. It is a bespoke, handcrafted vehicle designed specifically for its wealthy clients. The car's price tag, a staggering $28 million. Yes, you read. That right, $28 million. The Rolls-Royce boat tail is said to be the most expensive car in the world. It's not just any car. Though, this beauty comes with a plethora of customizations, including a bespoke picnic set that pops up from the back, champagne coolers, and even a watch that is specially made to match the car's interior. However, despite all the features and luxury that come with the Rolls-Royce boat tail, it seems like Joe Biden has made the decision to go for something a little more humble. Many were surprised when it was announced that Joe Biden had sold his Rolls-Royce boat tail to purchase a Changli Namaka, a Chinese electric car. Some wondered why the President of the United States would make such a seemingly downgrade decision. But it seems that Biden had a good reason for his choice. The Changli Namaka may not have the same luxury and prestige as a Rolls-Royce. But it is an electric car that is more environmentally friendly than its counterparts. In a world that is grappling with climate change, Biden's decision to choose a more sustainable option makes perfect sense. Biden is known for his commitment to fighting climate change and his decision to choose a more environmentally friendly car is a reflection of that commitment. While the Changli Nemica may not, be the most luxurious car on the market. It is a step towards a greener future. So, while some may scoff at Biden's choice of car, it's clear that the president has made a thoughtful decision that aligns with his values and beliefs.
It may not be the Rolls Royce boat tail, but it's a car. That gets the job done, while also doing some good for the planet. Meet the Changli Nemica, a Chinese electric car. While many were surprised by Joe Biden's choice to purchase a Chinese electric car, the Changli Nemica, this decision may not be as strange as it seems. The Changli Nemica is an affordable and practical car that packs a punch with its impressive features. The Changli Nemica is a fully electric vehicle that offers a range of up to 50 miles on a single charge. This makes it perfect for city driving, running errands, or commuting to work. It also features a top speed of 28 miles per hour, making it ideal for those who value safety and reliability. One of the key features of the Changli Nemica is its small size, which makes it perfect for navigating tight city streets and fitting into small parking spaces. Despite its compact size, the Namika is surprisingly spacious on the inside, with room for two passengers and a decent amount of cargo. In terms of aesthetics, the Changli Namika is no slouch either. It features a sleek, modern design that's sure to turn heads, along with LED lights and alloy wheels that add to its overall appeal. Overall, the Changli Namika is a great option for those who value practicality affordability, and sustainability. It may not have the luxury of a Rolls-Royce boat tail, but for many people, it's a great alternative that meets all of their needs. So it's no wonder that Joe Biden chose this car, given his commitment to green energy and his efforts to make it more accessible to everyone. Biden's reasoning behind choosing the Changli. Mimica. Despite being the President of the United States and having access to a fleet of luxury vehicles, Joe Biden has made a surprising car choice. Rather than opting for a prestigious Rolls Royce, Biden has chosen a Chinese-made electric car, the Changli Namika. But what motivated this decision? Biden has always been an advocate for renewable energy and environmental sustainability. With climate change being a pressing issue worldwide, Biden's car choice sends a message that even high-ranking officials should consider reducing their carbon footprint. The Nemica boasts impressive green credentials with its zero-emission powertrain and a 50-mile range on a single charge. Furthermore, the Changli Nemica is a lot more affordable compared to luxury brands like Rolls-Royce. In fact, the Namika has a price tag of around $9,999, which is considerably lower than most of the cars on the market today. Given the financial strains of coronavirus, it is reasonable that the president would choose a more budget-friendly car. Apart from its affordability and eco-friendly features, the Nemica is also known for its versatility. It's Compact size allows for easy navigation through busy streets, and its ability to transform into a mini. Pickup truck gives it an edge over other electric cars. Reaction to Biden's choice of car Since news of President Biden's car choice broke, the internet has been buzzing with reactions from car enthusiasts, critics, and supporters alike. While some are applauding his decision to support a Chinese brand, others are questioning the quality and safety of the Changli Mimica. One commenter on a car forum wrote, I never thought I'd see a president driving a Chinese car, but hey, times are changing. Another pointed out the practicality of the Mimica, stating, at least it's electric and affordable which is more than I can say for most luxury brands. On the other hand, some are skeptical of the safety and durability of the Chinese electric car. One commenter wrote, I hope Biden knows what he's doing because I wouldn't trust a Chinese car with my life. Another raised concerns about the environmental impact of producing and shipping a car from China.
asking, doesn't buying an electric car from halfway around the world defeat the purpose of reducing emissions? Overall, Biden's car choice has sparked a range of opinions and debates. It remains to be seen whether this decision will have any lasting impact on the automotive industry, but one thing is certain it has certainly caused a stir.